Hi everybody, this is Furkan from founder of book2wheel.com. I get a lot of questions about, I want to move to Europe, I want to start a business in Europe, how to get to Europe, all this type of question. Well, if you are a businessman, this should not be the question, at least first, first of all. The first question is that I have an idea, I'm working on it, we are we have tested the idea, we have this revenue, we want to expand the idea. And what should we do? How should we capture the market from one market to another market? We have fulfilled the sides in our market and now we want to go to another market. I think these are the good question. Um, I'm sadly to see those questions like, what's the way to get into Europe? Well, uh, there is no easy way to get into Europe, number one, because you are not trying to come as a businessman. You're just trying to find a way to get to Europe. And, you know, institutions in European countries are very smart. They have been dealing this uh, for years and years, and they have become very good into that. Now, there are some things, yes, you can do, but it's again, it depends on your attention, uh, you know, your faith good faith if you have a good faith and you really want to do something then nobody can stop you there's always a way to do the right thing well let me give you an example um, I live in Denmark I obtain a startup visa in Denmark which is only given to 76 people a year so there are thousands of applications come all over the world and only 76 people get this uh, startup visa now there are some requirements that you have to follow. Yes, I can help you and guide you in that. But if you say there is a magic thing that somebody can do it for you, no, there, there, there is something that has to be done behind it. So the number one thing, if you wanna apply for startup visa, you should have something already that you are doing it either in your country or somewhere else. And then you wanna expand that idea to Danish market or you already have something and you want to move this to in Danish Denmark market. Now, the the startup visa board will look at your application and see if this actually create a value to the Danish market. And then, yes, they might approve your case. That's the number one thing. The second thing is that how much capital you have and you're going to invest and you are not going to come to Denmark and going to apply for unemployment benefit. No, you're not going to get that. You have to sign it before you come in. The third thing, you have to have a large money in your bank account. If you are coming alone, that's I think is 135,000 Danish kroner. So you have to have a 10 to 12,000 a month. Um, so it depends on year how long you have a visa. So you have to have that in that cash in your personal account. Second thing, if you want to come up with, with your wife, kids, or your business partner, then this 135,000 Danish krona multiply into the number you are applying for. Now, if you are applying for as a team, you might have to apply three or four different applications, or you might be able to do it one application. When I applied it, I applied it for myself, and I, I got an... Uh, residence permit for myself which was for two years when i asked for my business partner they told me that he has to apply separately and then his application will be approved now these are the things you need to go through it there is a website which is startup denmark you have an application anybody from any part of the world can fill out this application if they feel that you have the right qualification you have a right mindset and you have a right team Yes, you will get it. So I hope this video helped you. Feel free to go to Startup Denmark website, make your application and see if you get successfully. If you need any help for my consultation uh, during uh, in your application, I can help you. Again, I'm not going to write an application for you. No, this is not my job. I'm going to guide you what you should have in your application and that's what I can really help you about it. I hope this video is helpful. Have a good day. Bye.